No, 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 no. The ethics advisor resigned because, if anything, the Prime Minister is too ethical and he couldn't keep up with all the ethics. No, no, no that's not a joke. OK, and you'll print that, will you, Rupert? Jolly good. See you soon. Morning, Minister. Ah, good morning, Neil. What are the hoi polloi moaning about this week, huh? Well, the Rwanda policy's been getting a lot of heat. Oh, really? Although it is on the equator. <laughs> is it? Yeah, anyway, the public don't seem to like it, and the European Court of Human Rights stopped the first plane from going. Mastered. Remind me, this is a policy whereby we force the refugees we don't like... The brown ones. The brown ones, yeah. This is a policy where we're forcing them to travel to some godforsaken, lawless, morally redundant hellhole, isn't it? Yes, and once they've arrived in the UK, we send them off to Rwanda. <laughs> OK, and that is...? A country. Of course. Well, I've had a long, hard think about it. Oh, yes? Just now, yes. And I'm starting to think. Let's do whatever we can to appease the floating voters, yes? Well, The Guardian has called it cruel. Yes, well, they would. I was just wondering whether it's... Um... Not cruel enough. No, not exactly. I just hear that Rwanda is... Um, Perfectly safe. Not quite. Full of beautiful women and sandy beaches? Not from what I hear. Well, that is the official line, so... Yeah, fair enough. But we still need to deal with the European Court of Human Rights and public opinion. Oh, let me guess. They probably want us to have an efficiently run processing facility within the UK, as opposed to needlessly transporting vulnerable people halfway around the world at great expense. They probably want us to be compassionate as well, don't they? And also, by the same time, having a well-run asylum programme whilst undermining the illegal traffickers by legitimising asylum routes, at the same time working perfect synchronicity with France and the rest of Europe, don't they? Yeah. Yeah, just a quick question. Why don't we? Why don't we what? Well, why don't we do all that? Um, I assume there's a good reason. Oh, yes. Well, some of the plebs want us to be as cruel as we can be to asylum seekers, and we really need their votes. So what line can we spin them? Well, we're going with the European Court of Human Rights is a disgrace that was set up to destroy us. Yes. Didn't we set that up? And this is exactly why we brexited, to get rid of such red tape. But the European Court of Human Rights has nothing to do with the EU. Indeed, but our testing shows that our core voters react very strongly to any sentence involving the word Europe. Right, so in a nutshell, what we're saying is that the well-being of vulnerable people who are trying to flee pestilence, persecution and war is secondary to the needs of the modern Conservative Party. Exactly, Sir Edwin. Uh, is that the quote you want me to give to the Telegraph? Yes, that sounds just about perfect. Jolly good. Thank you, Neil.